I'm Zyka Constantino and welcome back to the vlog. Um, this is um, a new vlog series because um, I feel like Diary of the Poet of a Poet ended last year, December 2022. I feel like this year is going to be my boss babe era. So yeah. So right now, um, right now my current project is the Brotherhood, and it currently holds um fifteen pages, and oh my gosh, I love the mystery. It's more like a mystery on who done it, and. Or who made her vanish. And yeah, that's the story. And I feel like the Brotherhood might have a title change. I feel like the title change is going to be the disappearance of Kitty Albright. So the stories in the title. Yeah. So I, I got changed into home clothes and I'm still wearing this <laughs> because it's comfortable. So um, I'm currently splitting my time between writing and posting gaming videos as a hobby and doing this vlog, which is actually a lot if you think about it. It's a lot. It's like content creation, plus writing, plus creating content for your writing, plus making stuff. So this is why I'm taking a break on TikTok because I know um, TikTok is a platform that I could grow my audience. And yeah, I have decided to take a break from TikTok. And once I get back, I'll have content um that features poems quotes from poems i wrote from poetizer and to get people to follow me on poetizer it's gonna be one heck of a ride so i changed the title of the brotherhood on my script on the title page um it now says the disappearance of kitty albright and it goes from past to the questioning room. That's all I'm gonna say. And with the script, with the writing of it, I wrote a page today, so like a page and a bit today, which all together comes down to 16 pages, which is a short film. 16 pages to 30 minutes short film. So yeah. Um, I added a little Easter eggs of like um, entertainment history because reading is entertainment and it's the oldest form of entertainment by far. And film history is the newest form of entertainment. So that's so one of the scenes talks about an actress named Claire Luz who I'll share pics of her at the end of this clip, but she was someone who got injured while doing a dance. In London and then she stayed in London to pursue her acting career that's where she is and yeah I hope there's a takeaway in the story because I wrote it with feminism in mind
So it's self-care hour, which means I get to play games, but no recording of games. And I only record when I have time. So that's why recording videos is a hobby for me. So I'll show you guys um, in a bit what I'm doing. It will be like me. It's not gonna be a screen recording. It will be me. It will be me, like pointing to stuff. Yep. So, I just finished building the neon pink strappy sandals. Um, a build machine. So I'm gonna collect that, and I'm gonna look for go now. I'm gonna look for stuff that I want to build footwear. The footwear is always amazing. That's why I build the footwears. I don't purchase them, I just build them. So it's purchased with time. I like this. Oh my gosh, look at the detail. Look at that! That is so pretty! Okay, let's build it. Outfit of the day in real life is just a blanket sweater and a dress. So I'll show you guys my Epic in Life outfit of the day. Here is my Avican Life outfit of the day. It's a corset, ripped jeans in white, and those heels, which you can't see over the text. So let me go into style. That is amazing. Very today, very 2020. And very streetwear. More like urban, but it's like barry urban. I get called. Uh, hey. Oh, hang on. In African life, I get called um, Barbie by players um, online. Like, they see my outfit and they just scream Barbie. I'm like, Wh why am I Barbie? I should be Ella Woods. <laughs> But they're like, no, your outfit is very Barbie. I was like, oh my gosh, thank you. Because Barbie is an icon. She's an icon. And she's a boss babe. And I was like, she's like Elle Woods. Likes her pink. But like, I go girly and I go street. I go urban with my style in game fashion and when it comes to real life and fashion i actually just wear whatever i want and i take in consideration what um clothes i put on my avakin and i translate that into real life so that's the boss babe tip if you're playing a game, translate whatever you're wearing in game into real life. So I'm gonna be listening to some music and eating Oreos. I love Oreos. <laughs> ah, I really love Oreos. So I ate two Oreos and now I'm watching how she ruled Paris from her bed which is about this um, courtesan, French courtesan who used to be poor, who grew up poor and then she mingled with the celebrities of that time and I was like I could learn from her social skills, you know? <laughs> mm -hmm. 
we could learn something from her. Um, we can we can actually learn something from the past. That's why watching um history videos. Um. Is learning something. And learning never stops. So that's it for this vlog. I'll see you guys in the next one. Ciao.